Oh. Lush and his girl are for sure smokers. You're going to lose your teeth again, Lush. Slow down, my boy. This is a screenshot from her most recent video that is purporting to be a, a meth pipe. That's what this appears to be. It absolutely is a and meth And this pipe. is foil, I believe. So this raises the question. That's Lush. a pizza with Xanax on it. That's a, okay, it's a pizza with it's, it's Xanax a pizza and with a meth Xanax. pipe. No, the, the, the meth pipe's next to the pizza, actually. Okay, besides the desecration of a valuable piece of pizza and valuable Xanax, what are do you smoke meth? No. At all? I've smoked meth twice or three times in my life. I've done a good amount of Who's meth. Who's smoking meth? Nobody's smoking meth. Then why is there a meth pipe? Because it's dope for the video. So the all right, since we want to talk about it. Yeah, air it out, because I don't know if I buy that excuse. No, check game. <laughs> check game. Check game. So uh my girl, <laughs> Germ Free, aka Bang Bang, um, has an album that she's dropping called Shadow Work. And one of the prevailing themes of the album is drug addiction and being able to circumvent and survive while being addled with this you know so she's actually she's like a method actor she's actually doing meth so she can rap about it better well there's no it was completely so i co-directed this video and it was my idea for her to use the meth pipe as a microphone because i, I thought it was compelling imagery uh -huh. it's nothing that hasn't been seen you know and if you go look at any soundcloud era rap video it's nothing crazy uh, damn near it's almost uh stereotypical having xanax on a pizza at this point we saw steve cannon in the xanax man video having a xanax on a but donut you, you used to like that's one thing we need to bring back side note is that you remember you would go to like a, a underground rap show in downtown la and the flyer would have like a bunch of clouds and a bunch of zans and some yeah. walk heart models and all that shit and it would be like you know that there's just gonna be a bunch of goth girls there and Craig. shit i miss that yeah, but, I okay miss, so you're I saying miss you, all the warehouse you, parties. my girl is one of those goth girls okay but you're saying that you went and procured a meth pipe, a single piece of pizza, and a bunch of Zans, and you arranged oh, them. And also, is this testosterone? Oh, oh, no. Oh, that, that's a Xanax bottle. That's like when you go oh, okay. into the... That's a Mexican That's Xanax. a Mexican. That's they a call Xanax those Xanax TLRs. Uh, Not Trap Laura Ross, Tijuana Life Runners. Those whoa. are... That's a bottle of yeah, Tijuana those, Life Runners. Those are fake. Yeah, they, 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 you know, they got a little, they con queso. You're putting Play-Doh Zans <laughs> on the pizza. No, they're not fake like that. No, nah, they, 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 they Mexican. They got a little kick. They just, they well, know. but anyone who goes to Mexico, you know that you'll see the pharmacies and it'll have a list on the outside of all the drugs that you can just walk in and buy. And yeah. on that list are a bunch of drugs that normally you have to go to the black market to purchase yeah. in sunny Los Angeles. Pharmacia. And it says testosterone, Xanax, but fucking. So, so the you know, Xanax were mine because I take Xanax and um and, and the the meth pipe yeah I procured the meth for the pipe video. isn't burnt I think yeah What's yeah it's, it, it's not no no that's like that's, like, uh, that's part it, it's not but you, it, it you there sure? is if you watch the video you might see people smoking meth in the video I I suggest people just look up Germ Free Bittersweet uh, produced by Benji Rowe what? great record and uh, just check out the video you might see so did y'all have J uh, yeah check out the video y'all. <laughs> you believe him? But no, no, I don't know. I did at first. So I you mean, might, I think that you might see people smoking meth in the video. I just want to know because then I had some people hit me up, sending me this me link to the Reddit, later, and man. people were were telling me that they think that Lush is like a meth head, and like, oh, this explains his behavior. And I'm like, ah, I feel like he's not like, like he might, you might give off a little bit of a methy vibe, but like not like a full blown. You give meth. off like an Adderall vibe. Exactly, but you never. That's good. Yeah. Me, Adderall meth, you know, it's similar compounds. I have never taken meth on this podcast or prior to this podcast. Oh, in, okay. in the entirety of my, but I've taken ecstasy. I've taken on here Adderall. Yeah, that's oh. meth. Yeah, so you know, ecstasy is meth. M e t h o d man, <laughs> but nah, crazy. Um, okay, so we, we hey, cleared as that up. As long as you guys That's are, a clip. As long as you guys are happy with... Um, Let me just title it. Adam confronts Lush about his alleged meth abuse. Look, hey. Smoke <laughs> it on that ecstasy. Hey. I mean, I really wanted to know. I figured I would ask you on here and as, let the as world as, in on it. As, as, long as, um, up, though, bro. As, as long as you guys are happy with uh, my I already performance. know you're on meth. <laughs> As long as you guys are happy with my performance on the podcast, rap. I'll smoke as much meth as you want. I never know what 
the Brig Baby concoction is on any given day. Yeah. Some people seem to think that I'm the one actually administering whatever you're on. Nah, man. It's just, you know, whatever lands in the bottle, lands in the bottle. Don't ask me about my cup. It's, it's my, my cup. cup. It's my cup. It's my cup. Hey, dickhead. Get your mind right. Don't preach to me about my perky habit. This it's is my, my life. life. Come on. <laughs> Free J. You know what I mean? So at the end of the day, my concoction is for sure a perk every day. But I didn't. I mean, the whole world could see I slowed down on drugs, right? Thirty a day? <laughs> nah. Ten a day? Maybe like a sixty ball. Two thirties. If you were gonna do two thirties in a day, what 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 time would you take each? Like ten a.m. Like you start real early. Half, 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 half. Oh, you spread it out like that. Yeah. I think that me and Brick are like <laughs> clearly in way better like state of mind when it comes to our drug use than we were a few months ago yeah. and anybody I, that can't see that yeah. so i'm about to say like a 45 on a, on a regular day okay like half maybe around noon half you know 